Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Jess from Jess Insight. Today I'm going to do a quick video of some Thanksgiving makeup tutorial. Um, so I'm going to show you how I'm going to do my makeup, get my, do my hair and my outfit, the whole nine yards. But definitely wish you and your family a happy Thanksgiving. Enjoy the grub, but you know, the food is not the only thing that has to look like a snack. So can you. So keep on watching and we'll get right into the video. The first thing I'm going to take is that Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz. Um, it is in the color dark brown. It is my sister's. I can't find mine right now, so I'm just going to borrow this real quick. I'm going to do my brows because you guys know I use this dip brow pomade more. So a pencil is a little foreign to me, but we're gonna we're gonna make it work. one done and I'm just gonna go like pretty pretty not light but pretty more outline phase of like what I'm wanting it to look like I'm gonna go like 70% because I'm gonna say 80% done with my brows so I'm gonna go back and clean it all up and get it to the shape that I want but this is good for now so I'm gonna take the other side and brush it out a little okay brows looking like cousins good enough we're going to go to my skin using the elf poreless face primer so we'll doll that. looking good okay now i'm going to start underlining concealing my brow a little so i'm just going to take this la girl pro concealer in the color fawn and i'm just going to go right under carve out the brow bam other one I'm gonna take the rest and conceal my. So I'm gonna go ahead and blend that in. Okay, so that's all done. Uh, so now I'm going to work on my face. So I'm going to take my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Cream Kit in the color Deep. So it has all these colors. I'm gonna take this middle coral shade right here. I'm gonna take that brush here. It's an elf brush, very old. There's no label on it, but I'm gonna take this dig into that coral and I'm gonna use it to color correct on my spots. Okay, this is enough. We don't wanna do too much. So, for my eye look today, I am wanting to use just one eyeshadow palette, which most of the time is hard for me because I like to like pick out of everything because I have so many, but we're going to stick to one. And the one I'm using today is going to be the Morphe Jaclyn Hill Armed and Gorgeous palette. So it's a little Morphe one, it's super cheap. I believe these are like 15 bucks. Um, so I'm going to open it. And as you can see, don't those colors look kind of fall to you? So I'm gonna try to make a look work from this. And I think it's gonna look super cute. So let's get started. I think the first color I'm gonna use is Agent just as a transitioning shade. So I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna drag the Agent all across my lid, just in the crease a little bit. A little down, it's not looking like much since, you know, my whole face is orange at this point. I think I'm gonna go into, take this brush here, I'm gonna go into Smooth Criminal, which is right here. Smooth Criminal, I'm just gonna swipe that right where I put Agent. It's a lot of blending. Blend, blend, blend. Perfect. What do I wanna do next? I think I'm gonna do a little bit of a kind of crease. So I'm gonna take this concealer, put that in, take it a little bit of a lighter concealer. I'm gonna go with the e.l.f. medium sand. It's really light, actually. So I'm gonna put that a little bit on my hand just to have something to work with. I'm gonna take this brush here to help me cut crease. Um, all right, I'm gonna take this brush here I'll tie here that much. And I'm gonna use that to cut grease. So, we're drawing it in. I 
did it really low. I'm gonna do the other side. It's not that clean of a cut crease, but there's cut crease in the Okay. I know I look crazy, but that helps me like draw by having like guidelines here and guidelines there. So ignore that. I'm going to wipe away our excess here and then wipe away the excess here. Usually I use a wipe, but I don't know where they are. So this is going to have to work. Okay. Okay, so next going back in that same palette. Remember every look is from this. So going back in that same palette and I'm going to take classified right here. I'm gonna start putting it in my inner duck like right on top of that. And classified is put on the lower line. Because I need more, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna grab this prowl right here next to classified. I'm gonna darken up my corners a bit. I am gonna go back and get the guilt trip up here and put it on top of classified because I think it still needs a little something, something. Guilt trip. Then I'm gonna take VIP, take VIP here, and put it in my inner corner. Might have to redo that after foundation, but you get what I'm trying to do. And I'm gonna go back into Agent from earlier, take it and side street right over Prowl, just to have more blending going on. And then I'm gonna take that concealer I did from earlier. I'm just gonna highlight right under my brow there. And I'll blend it out with my finger. And then do the same thing over here. Look how much a difference it is. Perfect. So that is all set. So I think I'm happy with how the eyes look. I'm going to cut up a little on my, this brow is a little thick to me. So I'm just going to clean it up just a tad. Brows look better. I'm going to take some clear brow gel and run it over. Just keep it in place. So next thing I'm going to put on is my, um, Cat Von D Tattoo Liner. I'm using my mini version. It is in the color Trooper Black. So, liner going on. Liner is on. I'm going to do some mascara here. And I'm gonna put my falsies on. On. Now we get to the fun part foundation. Taking my Fenty Beauty in the color 420. This is the liquid one and not the matte. Hydrating long wear foundation. Put like about four drops in my hands. Take a little bit of this. Start placing it. So I'm using the e.l.f. Found, uh, uh, Elf Hydrating Camo Concealer in the color Medium Beige and it's in the Satin Finish.
take this Fenty Beauty um, matcha stick. It's a contouring stick. It's in the color Espresso. Just a little bit down the sides of my nose because it is a dark color. So I'm going to take this e.l.f. contouring brush and I'm just going to I'm going to blend down the sides of my nose. So straight down. And then do it on the other side. I have a little bit of baking powder. This is a Revolution Banana Deep. I'm going to put some on my hand. Just like that. And I'm going to take some and let my foundation and I'm gonna do a little thing a little different I'm not gonna put too much I am just gonna pat it in so I don't have like such a kinky bottom pat 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 I'm gonna swipe like this contouring I just did and then do that on the other side need a little more and so while that contouring and all that is getting set I'm gonna blend it in some more by taking my puppy brush going into my Fenty Beauty Mocha Mommy and I'm just gonna set off that contouring I did with some bronzer I know it's a little scary, but I'll blend it, guys. Now I'm taking just a clean brush. I'm blending it in some more. While that's setting, I'm going even more. I'm going into my um, Bad Girl Bang Bang Benefit Mascara. And I'm going to go in mascara up these eyes. I'm set. I'm gonna take this big fluffy brush. Just don't want me know if that palette everywhere. Okay, now I'm going to this e.l.f. blush palette. These are the colors which are, like it says, extremely light. I'm going to take this more, mm, maybe this more orange one over here. I'm going to take just a little, so I'm going to go into that. And that's uh, the kind of my teeth. It works a little bit. I'm going to add on the top of that the one right underneath. So I'm going to go right here. Not too much. Finally, I'm going to go into highlight. I'm going to go again to my favorite dose of colors. Chasing the sun, and I'm going to. So I'm going to highlight here, up, right here. I'm going to go back and use my lip oil. I'm using the Ultra Beauty Juice Infused. Taking a little bit of that. And I put that lip oil on. Now I'm going to use the a lip product here. I think I'm gonna go with the Milani one, Amore Matte Cream. It's in the color Cobbit, which is one of my favorites. I don't think I'm gonna put on a lip liner today. We're winging it, so. put a little bit of a center I'm gonna go in with the NYX lip lingerie um, in the color ruffle trim I'm gonna put that right in the center of my lip I'm 
And then I'm going to put the Fenty Beauty Fussy. It's a lip gloss just to get some additional shine. And I just kind of stab it on just so I don't pick up too much product. And that is it. That is my makeup look. Hopefully it is cute to y'all. I'm going to go ahead and do my hair, put on my outfit, and show you the rest. Hair is looking like. I don't know if I want to put in some curls or some waves. I feel like my makeup's already doing too much. I don't really need to like bless over my hair. Hmm. I think it's fine. I'm gonna put it on my dress and show you next. Hey guys, so this is the finished look. Hair done, makeup done, dress on, ready for Thanksgiving. Thanks again for watching guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys!